Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Look at it outside. We are under a winter storm watch today. A well, weatherman said today up to 12 inches and then I think three or four more tomorrow. So this is what we have on the ground already. It's, um, I don't know, you can't really tell. There's a few inches there. We've had a lot of rain in between. You can see on the porch floor, we get a little dusting on here. Not too bad. And this is the Pottinger Garden. Everything is sleeping. Ooh, that snow is blowing in here and it's so cold. Oh my gosh, look at it. Look at all that loveliness. Oh boy. I'm always so thrilled with winter. Not really. Can you hear the sarcasm in my voice? <laughs> I'm over this. In my 52 years on this earth, I'm over this. I'm, I'm done. I just... I just want to fly south on a goose and just enjoy good weather for once. <laughs> but it is beautiful, isn't it? It's just beautiful. On the inside of the house, we have a nice warm fire going. Yes, it is cold outside. I haven't done much in the way of decorating this year because I broke my ankle. So I have not been able to do a whole lot, but I'll show you here. I have my little Boyd's bear, my stuffed bear. I've had him for many, many, many years. The kids love him. We have the fire going. I don't even have my stockings up yet, <laughs> but I will get them up. The mantle is very simple, very simple this year. I just uh, didn't want to put a whole lot up because I didn't want to have to take a whole lot down. I've got to have surgery next month, so simple is best this year. So in this corner I have our oil lamps and a tree. The tree is just going to balance the mantle because I have trees on the other end as well. And over here in the center I have my woodsy Santa. I love my Santa Claus. And another tree with some lights and a book called The Visit. I think this is the story behind The Night Before Christmas. Um, I believe that's what the, uh, it's the original, I think. Here's my Santa. Isn't he sweet? He's got a little lantern. His robe has some reindeer. It's all stitched. He's so adorable. I just love him. Anne, I know you'd love him for your collection. I love your collection. Anne Clay. She has a uh, YouTube channel and she has many, many Santas and I'm so jealous. Up here we have a picture, Oh Holy Night. That's usually the one that hangs on my porch when I decorate my porch, but this year it's going to hang up over my mantle because it's just something simple. We have some pine cones. Pine cones are actually hiding the cord. <laughs> so, but they they look purposeful. And here we go over here. Like I said, the tree on the other side is just balancing the trees on this end. We have the elf house. There's a little glowing light in the elf house. It's um See if we can get this to focus a little bit. There we go. The elf house 
the tale goes that if there is smoke coming out of the chimney, the elves are at home. So the kids always look around because the elves like to leave little things around, little gifts or little candies or different little things. So the kids always look up to the elf house to see if the chimney smoke is going so they'll know whether or not the elves are home. So that is really all I did for our mantle. I didn't do a whole lot. Like I said, I didn't want to have to take down a lot. And honestly, I couldn't go up and down our stairs, not with a broken ankle. I don't know how I broke it. If you're wondering, I, I don't know. Uh, 13 years ago, I had a surgery, corrective surgery, and they put a screw in my ankle. And the screw has broke through the bone and gone up into the cartilage. And yeah, I've got to have the screw out and have the damage repaired. So that is coming up in about six weeks. Yeah, I've already waited about eight. And uh, now I've got six more weeks to wait. And it's not been easy. But I figure if I can get through three natural births, this has got to be a breeze. So this is the mantle and you can see up here on the light I did do some berries. I didn't turn this light on because it's rather hard to see with that light on. But there's some berries on there. It's really the only place that I've decorated. Um, we do have a tree up. It's an artificial tree. Uh, it's usually the one I have upstairs in the hallway. It just sits in the closet upstairs and remains decorated. So I just had that one brought down and here it is had that brought down and it's all decorated lights are already on it I mean I say it's decorated it just has little candles on it I just like the look of it I mean it's just simple and I like this room to be simple I love it and I think the ceiling just adds so much more. Thank you for watching today. I know this is a short video, but like I said, this has been a little bit of a challenge. I will do a Christmas tour, but that is going to be a little bit something different. So if you haven't already subscribed, you're going to want to because you're not going to want to miss out on this. Trust me, it's going to be amazing. So hit your notification bells and until next time.